everybody. I know I look crazy, so don't even say anything. Well, welcome to my channel, first of all. I am doing a video on how I do my slick back bun. So if you wanna watch how I make my hair look from caca to amazing, keep on watching. So I'm gonna start off with um, this hair oil and just my hair alone. My hair is very greasy right now, like extremely, slightly. Massage it. Um, I'm finally able to put my hair in like a ponytail, which I could before, but only if a style was still my hair. But I'm about to cut my hair again, so I'm not even getting too excited because I'm about to cut it a little bit shorter because it's touching my shoulders and I want it like back here. If you think I'm done with oil, I'm not. So I'm gonna go in with my, is it Chebby? I don't wanna say it here, mom, but it's hair grease. And I'm not gonna put um, it on my edges because for the style, I have to flat iron my edges just a little bit and I don't want that to burn it. I use this hair grease to obviously grow my hair and it just adds, Oh, I love the way it smells. It just adds like a shine. Cause I like my hair to look really shiny. Why? Because you know, I can't add water to it, it's gonna curl up. Or if I don't wanna add water to it, so I add oil, and it's going to um, just make it look better. Then I'm gonna go in with my herbal hair growth oil and put some more in. I go crazy with the hair oil, y'all. Y'all probably gonna say it too. Oh, it just broke my hair, oh no. Hold on. Oh my God, y'all. How do I get this back in? Maybe that was God's way of telling you to stop. Oh, never mind. I'm gonna put just a little bit more. Put it in there, my back. And then, and as you can see, it's very shiny, right? It's getting, it's getting wet and it's not wet. So I have to go in with my hair cream. So I put a lot. I'm probably gonna add some more. So don't get mad at me, y'all. But this is for moisture too, cause you gotta keep that hair moisturized. So I put it all throughout my hair. I want my hair very nice and moisturized. And that's why my hair has probably been growing so fast because I do my part. I absolutely do my part. I don't just let my hair dry up. Um, I don't oil my scalp as often, but I've been starting to um, get my hair. I'm actually gonna start wetting it soon and not keeping it straight so it can really absorb in. But I've been making sure I don't just wait till like a day before for my hair appointment. I take a couple days before to get my hair treated and treat my hair myself. And then my hairstylist, she'll go in with you know her products, her aloe and stuff like that to keep it moisturized. So anyways, as you see, I'm combing it. I'm still, I still work it from the roots down even though my hair is straight. Still comforters now. My hair is shedding, but natural shedding. So now I wanna decide how high I want my pony with my bun. I don't want it too low. I want it like middle. So I'm gonna brush it up as much as I can. Um, This you could do with natural hair too. Trust me, I did it when my hair was curly. I used to do this style all the time. Um, same products. I literally use the same products from when my hair was curly. So I'm gonna try to get it as high as I can because I know that back is gonna like pop out. So I'm gonna get it as high as I can and brush it up. So I want it pretty high and centered in the middle. And if it comes out a little bit, it's okay. I'm not really tripping. Again, this is just for me to keep my hair out of my face tomorrow at the gym. So I'm gonna get it as tight as I can. Now, I don't usually like using these because they do, sometimes they'll pull your hair out, but it's just for this video in one day. Um, I have to get the elastic, I don't think they're elastic, or hair ties that don't rip your hair out, or I use scrunchies. But a scrunchie to me just can't get it as tight as I want, which obviously that's good. But anyways, I'm gonna take it here. Sometimes I have to do this a couple times. I'm gonna take it, loop it, loop it again, and then I'll go in and twist it up. Cause my hair's so short. Twist it up and go around. But you see, I don't like how that looks. So I'm going to do it again. 
There we go. I don't even need to banana clip it. Okay, so now I'm going to obviously slick it back some more. And again, I don't expect it to be perfect. It's so weird. You would think that it would come out more perfect with this because it's smaller rather than a bigger scrunchie. And I wish I would have used my black scrunchie, but it's okay. I forgot it downstairs. So anyways, now what I'm going to do is do my edges. So I'm going to take my baby hairs out. I do like a dramatic little edge sometimes. So I'm just going to do it. And then sometimes I like to put my baby hairs back a little bit more and not have as much out. Um, yeah. I like my baby hairs to look very soft. This is too much. I want them to look really soft and cute and whatever. So another thing I use to mold my baby um, hairs is my mousse. You can use any mousse. I use Tresemme. Is this Tresemme? Yes. So anyways, my hair again is very oily, very cute. And now I'm gonna go in with my little flat iron. I love this flat iron to death. It is the best. It is truly the best. But I'm just gonna take out as many baby hairs as I want. And then if it's too much, I might go back and pull it back. But anyways, I'm gonna clip them, pull them under and curl it downward. And yes, it's gonna smoke a little bit because my hair has oil in it. So don't say it's smoking too much, it's smoking too much. Dad have oil in it. It's like when you cook food, fried chicken. That's what I wanna do too. I wanna fry up some chicken. That's why I might order. See, I have ADAD or ADHD, my mind is all over the place because first I'm talking about hair, then I'm talking about frying up some chicken, then I'm talking about tacos, now I'm talking about red beans and rice from Popeyes. I really want red beans and rice from Popeyes. So I might just order that tonight. It's not good and healthy for you, but I love me some red beans and rice. And to me, Popeyes got the best red beans. Um, again, my hair is very oily, so if it wasn't as oily, it would come out like a little bit fuller and better. It's like trying to um, flat iron greasy hair. It's gonna look stringy and whatnot. So that's why sometimes I gotta bring out a little bit more baby hair. Okay, so that's all I'm gonna do. I'm not putting any more heat to my hair. Um, I don't put heat to my hair like that. Hold on, I have to redo this one because it's a mess. I don't put heat to my hair um, after I get it done. Let me just leave it alone. Sometimes I might do my edges, but that's it. So now I'm gonna take my little edge brush. Is it just me? But I like my edge brush to be hard, okay? I don't really clean it that often. But anyways, we're gonna brush the edges down to mold them to how you want them to look. I don't do baby hairs here. That to me, that's just really ugly. So I'm gonna mold them. And to me, this is the key to stop baby hair. We're gonna mold them. We'll brush them into place. So I'm gonna take a little bit of the mousse and we're gonna put it on. And we're gonna put it on this. But we're gonna see how soft and pretty that is? Just lightly, literally lightly. He's going through the baby hairs. And I'm sorry I'm talking less because I get real concentrated. But then I'm going to take the little fork, I call it the little fork, and go um, make it like a, y'all see that? It's like a double baby hair. It's like first and sweet. I just love a um, slick back moment. And I need to do my hair like this more. I just don't, and I don't know why. I really just don't. But I'm gonna start doing it way more. Who cares? This, now I don't know what this got going on. This is not working right now. Usually I would curl, but I'm just gonna push it up. Now I'm gonna take the rest of the mousse and put it on top of my hair. And this is just gonna hold it. 
So now what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna put a scarf on. I'm gonna let it sit for like five minutes. I'm gonna let it sit for like five, 10 minutes. And then take it off and I know I'm gonna have to redo my baby hairs cause it doesn't matter, they're still gonna smush. Like they're literally still gonna smush. So yeah. Which obviously I'm going to bed tonight so it really doesn't matter but I'm trying to show y'all what I would do. Like for real. I'm gonna do one more pump. I like it real, real slippery, feel me? Real wet, real slippery. And all that fun stuff. I just love me some loose. I just do. It just helps get everything in place. Anyways, y'all. I um ordered my beans and rice and Popeyes, fed my dog. And now I'm about to show y'all my hair. And I know I'm gonna have to fix my edges, so don't say anything. See, it's super slick. Now I'm not gonna fully fix them now because I'm gonna be putting my scarf on soon. But all you gotta do is just rebrush them out and they're gonna go back to how they was. Just gotta rebrush them a little bit. Now this, I don't even want this here because it's too long. But it is what it is. I'll fix it tomorrow. Usually it'll swirl and then kind of do that. But, and this is sticking out. I gotta put that up tomorrow. But y'all can kind of just see, that is how it looks. It's super cute. It's a cute little side bun and whatnot. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe for more hair tutorials and videos. Um, I'll put a little bit of oil in there just so it's not dry. Y'all know I love my oil. But I'm gonna use my whole oil. Cause I don't know if mousse is drying. It probably is, but I'm gonna put a little bit and just do that. It's gonna keep it shiny and moisturized with all the product on top. And this was used without any got to be, any type of holding gel. This is all, all stuff that's easy to remove from your hair because uh, I love a good slick back bun or middle part pony, but the stylist just used so much got to be, oh my gosh, and then when my stylist does wash my hair, it makes it hell to get it out. Like it honestly makes it hell to get it out. Watch me some snowfall or something. Watch something on TV, maybe some YouTube. Probably some Bobby um, outside for some. That's my girl Bobby. I love me some Bobby. So I'm about to probably watch her. Cause I know she has a new episode with Shaquille O'Neal. No, and um, is it Jay ba Balvin? Balvin? So I'm about to watch that. But anyways, y'all, I just wanted to show y'all how I do. Do not mind this piece, but my slick back bun. And it doesn't have to be perfect. That's not my point. I just like the front to look good. This is just something I like to do when I'm about to get my hair washed. So anyways, I love you all so much. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.